Okay, sweet, we're in there. We are, we're on the airwaves. I'm looking at the Snoop Dogg Wikipedia page, which is very detailed. <laughs> it says... Anything newsworthy happened between Friday and now? I don't think so. That's why I'm looking at the, this fucking Snoop Dogg page. Because it says, in, in 2000... Wait, what is this? Oh, it says Other Ventures. Under the Other Ventures subheading for the Snoop Dogg Wikipedia page, um, it says, in 2000, Snoop... In parentheses, as Michael J. Corleone directed Snoop Dogg's Doggy Style, a pornographic film produced by Hustler. So there's a Snoop Dogg porno. I didn't realize that. Uh, the film is he in it? I don't think so. It's just that he directed it and then star in it. It says the film combining hip hop with X-rated material was a huge success and won top selling release of the year at the 2002 AVN Awards. The adult video. Awards, I assume. Snoop then directed yeah. Snoop yeah, Dogg's Hustlers. Yeah, Snoop, Snoop then directed Snoop Dogg's Hustlers, Diary of a Pimp in 2002, using the nickname Snoop Scorsese. <laughs> He's fucking... <laughs> oh. What an alias. Fantastic. So he just did a couple of pornos in the early... It was very early... 2000s which means it was definitely in the phase where he was just like whoring himself out to anything like any uh industry that would pay him but like before his um his image was like completely sanitized so he could still yeah. direct like pornos and stuff this is a great martha effort. stewart that's what i thought too <laughs> yeah exactly yeah we got the um the jimmy buffett scene from uh, jurassic park on the uh on the intro here we had to slow down we had to slow down though so you can appreciate um you know the king parrot head here kind of skippy but it, it, like it like freezes on him so it's good it's two handing those margaritas probably taking those bad boys to margaritaville which i can't i can't tell if that's like an allegory or a real place or not i think it might have just been like some sort of vision of an Edenic paradise that existed in his heart and maybe not like a real a real place he could go to, but I don't know. It's where the Archons live. Exactly. Is it a real <laughs> place in, in Florida? Alright, well. Never mind, man. Oh, it is, a, it, it is a chain of restaurants, isn't it? Or, oh wait, it says, Jimmy Buffett's Margaritaville is a United States-based hospitality company. Oh, that manages and franchises a casual dining American restaurant chain. Okay, so it just is fucking stupid. Like head. Yeah, I know there was one in like Virginia. Virginia when I would go down there a long time ago. Nice. I wonder if there's one in Louisiana. Let me see. Um, it doesn't look like it, but it says in 2011, Paradise Casino LLC unveiled plans for the Margarita Zil Margaritaville. Resort Casino to be built in Bossier City, Louisiana. Whoa, that exists? Yeah, it apparently does. I don't know this. I mean, it's nowhere near uh, where I live. It's Oh, it's in fucking northwest uh, Louisiana, which is basically a different state, so that explains why I didn't even know. Oh my god, what's up there? That's basically just Arkansas. It's Once you get out of southeastern Louisiana, it's just all... Um, you get you get rid of like the francophone Catholic culture and it's all just like English mm. Protestant bullshit. So it's, uh, it's very bland. The real real South begins there. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Sorry to anybody anybody from North Louisiana, but I've never. You, you might as well not exist. <laughs> no, it's <I'm just> kidding. <laughs> yeah. Fuck you. It's okay. Oh, well, that's good to know. All right, let's start that game up. Though we talked about Snoop Dogg's porno. We talked about Jimmy Buffett. We hit all the bases. <laughs> so let me. Help. Yeah, we're set. Let me turn the sound back on for this game. There you go. So what we got here? All right, so we got. I, I did some grinding off screens to where we went from level fourteen to twenty. I fused a Helfus. And I pumped his ass up with uh, grimoires, so he's 
He's level 19. He can actually go one level higher now. So let's get him. There you go. Got a nice little dance that he does when he levels up. It's pretty good. Love his dance. He doesn't have, well, he, he has all three uh, debuffs, so he'll be, he'll be useful. I also got all the fucking um, apples and abscesses, so... Pretty cleaned out here. You can just do the rest of the, the main story now. How much glory do we have? Um, I used it up already. We have like 45 left, but I, I got all the stuff that I, you would really want at this point. That's not Todd Howard. Come on. It's Todd Mode. Oh, the Mode Clan. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we gotta kill some demons for these angels. You gotta do this. So do you, do you just fight Nuwa still at the end of the... At the end of, the, at the end of uh, what you call it? Whatever this part of uh, the dot is, I don't know. Honestly, I forget. I thought you played the game four times. I have. <laughs> <Jeez. laughs> Alright, let's see. Oh shit, you got red yeah, Guma. Take you. Take you on. I honestly forgot this was like a mechanic and I thought that was just a graphical glitch. Um yeah. let's see. They give you incenses if you beat them. Hell yeah. I'm not doing a lot of damage to him man. How do you feel about Mazar? There you go. I won't skip your animation. He seems to be more resilient than the regular one. I'll just kill this guy first. What? Come on. Now oh, they have fucking force turns. Well, my drain lighting, so. I can't def no. Raccooned him. Set my ass up. Very cool, what? I'm glad I didn't use that on Todd. Uh, Jesus Christ. That was close. Just me and health is just like it should be. Thanks, bud. Didn't need that shit. There's another one down there. Well, I'm gonna ignore him because they're kind of strong. But, um. Put on safety. Just do it. Oh, yeah, I do have safety now because I got the DLC on. I haven't tried any of that out. Um, let me see. I forgot they gave me the, the like, infinite use healing item and the, uh, also infinite use almighty attack, which is. Yeah, that's decent for now. Seems pretty crazy, yeah. I don't need to actually summon him. Honestly, I think there's no new one this, this route. There's no there's new one. Nama replaces her. Oh, right, yeah. Okay, I was wondering, like, that, that was already a pretty big boss fight, so... There you go. I gotta remember to save constantly, because, uh... This game does Then we're gonna fight Nama again. Uh, when is that? Just, like, way later in the game, I assume, or...? Yeah, after this. Oh, really? <laughs> what the fuck? In between areas, I think. Yeah. Weird. Thought it would have been spaced out. You know where to go? Yeah, just on the map. I gotta go around. Back into the right. Yeah. Oh shit, Kusumi Tom again. Get back here. Even without the the uh, Mitama DLC on, it seems like there's a lot more Mitama just hanging out. I got like a dozen while I was grinding for like an hour. Let me see. This'll do. I'm about to get another level off of this bad boy. What am I talking about? I wonder if we should invest in Vitality too. Since without level scaling, that's like your only defensive stat. Yeah. Oh, probably worth it. I think I'll get. I think whenever I get like the 
that bonus is from Malgami, I'll put it in Vitality. There you go. Here we go, Elphys. That's right. We're still using Angel, because she's the only one who has, um... Like a Medea-style skill. Although I guess we have that item, but I'm not sure if that even heals as much as, as Medea. Yeah, it's pretty weak. Yeah, I thought so. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, it's through here. That way. I gotta unlock this. Stop talking. It's down here. Or is it a chest? I'll take that. You guys suck me. I'm getting sucked. Oh, man. <laughs> you want some? Well, do ya? Fuck, oh, dude. Nozuchi is like the Nancy Reagan of SMT with all the sucking he's doing. <laughs> the best sucker in Dot. Yeah. <laughs> Seems like there wouldn't be anything up there. Oh, I guess there's this bullshit. Wow. That's like the funniest story of politics of the 80s. Yeah, Nancy Reagan used to just fucking walk into the Oval Office and it would be like... Uh, like the beginning of the Cell Saga when Cell went around <laughs> like sucking that, that like this entire city <laughs> dry. <laughs> <laughs> Just be fucking withered husk. Just like, she leaves with a bunch of fucking, <laughs> just like empty suits on the ground everywhere. I don't want to fight these guys. Fuck. <laughs> now I pissed them. Oh great. Express turns. You fucking great. She sucked their souls and gave them to, gave them to Ronnie. Yeah. <laughs> That's why Ronald Reagan's soul meter was always maxed out. Everybody was like, how is this guy doing it? <laughs> He's always got his special ready. <laughs> yeah, we're going to be out of the desert soon. We promise. Yeah, and, and into, into this, the, uh, this the this other desert. desert yeah. <laughs> we're going into the red desert next. The even better desert. I should have saved. Yeah, we're pretty high level. Oh, these guys are easy. Plus I got that Shiva incense, so I think we're good. Unless they use ice and then we're fucked. But all three of these guys are red, so there's no way. <laughs> but they're higher level than I thought they would be. Let me see how much damage the um The bullshit thing does. What is it called? Um Gleam Grenade. Yeah. Gleam grenade. Eh, it's pretty weak. But also, I'm not sure if it scales off my magic or not, so... You should. Shit. That was a bad start to this fight. Oh, at least he's weak to that. Nice. Oh, hell yeah, I drained fire. Nice. Done, buddy. I know you're weak to that shit. God, I really want to learn. I mean, unlock the ability to get like more skills from essences, whatever the hell that's called. Because, uh, you get like null fizz yeah. from one of them. Wait, can the protagonist use passive resistance skills? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, then we're gonna be fucking. Smooth sailing from that point on. You're also weak to it, jeez. Good job, Alphys. You're my favorite of the party. <laughs> These other bozos can blow me. Let's see, let's, uh, let's do that. Nancy Reagan style. <laughs> oh no.
use your physical attack. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, I thought you'd use your little sword. Come on. What if Dancer Dragon sucked, sucked off Shinzo Abe? Shinzo, uh, I think that would have... It would have somehow led to peace in the Middle East. I don't know how, but... <laughs> it would have accomplished it. It's all the same bullshit from last playthrough. I don't need to. Yeah, that's the same thing. thing. Yeah. Oh, but here we go. We get the commentary from Yoko. So it's super different, actually. Yeah. Hey. No way. Are we being, like, used by the guys that are using us? Wow. No. Amazing. Well, that gave me, like, a whole new perspective on the events of Shin Megami Tensei V. Uh... <laughs> We're back. Let's see. Ooh, yeah. Well, this feels like something I shouldn't be able to do. <laughs> Pretty good. Angels are the real bad. I get out of here. Angels are the word, real demons. Yeah. I love this check mark. Oh, it's a little rock. The angels guarding the path are gone. We were on it. This is the first parry out. Hell yeah. Are there any video game adaptations of uh like Dan Brown novels or movies that were based on his novels? Like is there an Angels there and a Demons a GBA game? game? <laughs> yeah, I'd really like to know. Just the Creed, I guess. I guess pretty much, yeah. Servants of Heaven, Periot. What the fuck is a Periot? I should know what that is. I'm detecting the presence. I think it's like a talisman or something. Like that. that makes sense. Something fancy. Oh, Algami one. Oh, Algami and Alphys. Jeez. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. There we go. Hmm. I agree. Hmm. Slaying them was beyond. You couldn't kill two Andres and one Elagor? You guys fucking suck. <laughs> Hell yeah. Alright, I'm gonna dump those into Vitality. Yeah, Yoko is extre is like very extremely transparently a new character for the re-release. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Yeah. You say true? The angel is agreeing with me for nothing. What about you, Demon? How do you feel about that angel over there? You're just kind of like, kind of a goofy little guy. Whoa, you have a deep voice. Thanks, Alphys. You're not jerking me around like the other demons. Cool. He's pretty good. I'm glad they ended him. Yeah. How are you gonna use the medicinal properties of your whore? And you gotta cut that bad boy off and then like grind it. No wonder you guys are usually in captivity. Yellow, yellow, dumb. All right, let's get out of here. I guess I could talk to Algami again. Young man. Nice pose. So cool. Holy shit, dude. Do they program him to look fucking awesome all the time? <laughs> sure. Thank you. It's fascinating. 
this Algami bench bonding mechanic that they added would have been like a really good um opportunity to expand on his characterization, but yes. um No. Yeah. Nope. It's a game changer. Yeah. Dude, she's just sitting on the rubble, and that's like, you're not even supposed to sit on that, so you can tell she's kind of different, she's kind of badass. Yeah, she seems fine. She doesn't play by the rules. You can use Agi and Muda. It's kind of evil, if you ask me. Agi and Mudo. I mean, she's bad. Yeah. Yo, Algami Essence. Whoa, what did they do to this guy? What? Oh, he's just kind of hanging. I thought he was a crucified. That was... It's gonna be too when I saw this at first. <laughs> what happened? Algami is the real Jesus. Jeez. You guys... Weaker than two Andres ass Algami. Let me get that Essence. Yeah. What the fuck? Oh, it's Helfus times three. Hell yeah. The family of Helpless? <laughs> I didn't see this. Really? I love rotisserie chicken. I know about Helpless, I got a Helpless. Sure thing. Oh. Father help us? I assume that's who I'm talking to. Seem like you're taking charge. <laughs> he has some. Oh my. <laughs> Even in this fucking cutscene, they use this. <laughs> they use this composition. It's so fucking funny. Holy shit. Alright, buddy. I don't know what you want me to do. I assume you want to go over to that, like, place with the mermaids, or maybe Anahita's spot, I don't know. Yeah, I think, um... What the fuck is her name? Yoko, is that her name? Yo yeah, Yoko. I think, I, think, I think Yoko is gonna end up being, like, uh, the goth girl from the Breakfast Club. We're gonna, we're gonna give her a makeover that makes her look way worse than she did before. It's cheaper than I thought. I've only gotten like nine Mimon. I haven't been on on top of that at all. Now they're just infesting the map, making everything else hard to make, that hard to see. Cool. You can turn them off if you want. That's alright. I'm not doing anything else down there. Wow. I don't see. Well, I don't want to see another Mimon again. Yeah, I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna be doing the head-on screen, so I don't worry about it. You wanna go to the Oni cave? Oh, okay. Where's that apple? There it is. Hell yeah. That was delicious. And it's gonna keep the doctor away another day. <laughs> Oh, whoops. I thought you were down there. Yo, it's me, Mon. Whoa. I don't care what you have to say about trains. <laughs> you have an insane voice. What is this? It's like a virtual battle. Oh, no, he's, he's a, a navigator. Demon navigator. Oh, sweet. Can I switch switch him out? Or do I have to wait until the plot takes her out? God damn it. 
Go back to the gear, Leilon. And the uh, this last thing. Where's that? No. I'm not gonna look for it. Fuck it. Is he hanging around here or? Should be, I think. I see some random ones up there, but. Just Nigi Mitama. To the green icon. Yeah, let me do this first. Here. We too boofu, damn. Oh, I see it, yeah. Nice. I didn't realize he would be a demon navigator. He's big as fuck. That was all just little guys. What? I really gotta wait for her to leave. Damn. I honestly didn't even realize she stayed with you this long. I thought... Like, bailed halfway through in the original game, but maybe not. I wanna- I wanna go into the... Uh, Cathedral of Shadows to... Learn some... some miracles, but um... Whenever I do that, it introduces a graphical glitch song. I guess I'll wait. Wait till later. Yeah, let's move things along. Yeah. Observant, no oh god, me damn. Alright, so there is Nua there. She's doing her brat walk. I thought she was gonna have the same glitch again, but it was just for a second. Not those reinforcements, I presume. Wow, you look as good as always. As the last time we played the game. <laughs> there it is. Oh, that you look really good. God damn, why is it not consistent? The timing was a tad off. Keep your guard up, young man. I sense a dreadful power in this one. Yep, there it is. I got I guess it's a distance thing? Because whenever she gets closer, it goes away. It didn't say there was a strong demon ahead, so I assume I don't have to fight her. Yeah. Oh wait, or is she fighting me? Yeah, I guess so. Unless she's just doing this for fun, that'd be weird. I went to Fuse before this happened. I also don't remember... They forget. I don't remember what element she uses, and I'm pretty sure we're vulnerable, but... Is it wind? Yeah, she uses force. Fuck. Well, we're only weak to, uh... What you call it? Nice. Yeah, this is where the level scaling is really brutal. This fucking new it's weak to fire. Weak to, oh yeah, we got one guy with fire, so that's be better. That's, who's weak to? Are oh, you weak to force? So you gotta go. Who blocks that shit? Fortuna. There you go. What about Todd? Oh, you got nothing on force. Damn. I was hoping that was one of the ones you drained. Whatever. Fuck, all I can do is use force, though. Eh. Do that first. What level is she? Whoops. I thought we were over-leveled, but I guess not. Not that it matters anymore. Did you watch that video about the... Hell yeah. Damage calculation. Uh, I skimmed through it. Uh, it was super granular, so I couldn't yeah, really make it all the way through. But yeah, it's really insane how like modern RPGs do damage calculation. They're constantly using the root of the pie and shit. I don't like that. Um, 
Yeah. You don't want to heal yourself, actually. Actually, we don't have anybody who can multi-heal. Hell yeah. How dare you target Elphus? Oh, we don't have, um... God damn, the fucking... What you call it? The debuffs last, like, nothing. No turns. There you go. Do you have any fire gems? <laughs> fire gems? I think so. Yeah. I'll just keep using that instead of wasting the uh, Todd's turns. We have a fire shard at least. Doesn't do much. They're not as powerful. <laughs> oh wow. I wear a critical fuck, I should have used that. Ugh. Whatever. Well, you're gonna use items too. Oh, she can? Oh, nice. And you should, I'll use her you to... should have a uh, lifestone chains too. Yeah, it's true. You have that uh, heal item too. Nice. An infinite. Now, let's see how much that heals actually. I'm curious. Oh, it should be all the way up there. It's eh. called the Hara Edo Bead. It does okay. Fuck, now you're doing it? I wanted to do mine. <laughs> God damn it. Um, you can pass because you block force. I think that's what she's gonna do. So you guard. Yeah. Oh, I debuffed us? Fuck, dude. I really missed my chance to do a get a. Uh, oh my god, Toki. Whatever. The raccoon is coming, buddy. I keep critting, too. Damn. Yeah, this fight is way more manageable without the level scaling. It's kind of crazy. Oh, we're still debuffed. Whatever. Crit with that man. You're a great little bird. Bosses are still fucking damage sponges though, so that's fun. Alright, next turn I'll do it. Fuck, she's doing it again? Oh my god. Uh. Right, you got it. You know, I'm gonna use I'm just gonna use a force dampener on the last turn. Fuck it. Um now yeah, you gotta keep keep it up. Oh my god, what a bad luck, holy shit. Should've, should've made Yoko use it. Well, I would've done that if um, we'd have missed, but... Uh, you are out of MP. Signus Guard, I guess. Nice try. Man... Does this battle end before HP reaches, reaches zero? I think that's how it works, right? Yes, it does. Okay, mm -hmm. thank God. There you go. Wow, that was way sooner than I thought it would be. We got nothing from that play. Oh, it's this guy. I thought you'd be cleaning up the stragglers, but he looks like no angel I've seen. Does he ever take his hat off in this this version of the game? 
My name is Shohei Yaku. I think he does. Exterminator of demons. They should have given him like a. They should have given him like a fade or something for uh, for vengeance. Take solace in our meeting, boy. I'll make your death a painless one. I resist physical attacks, bitch. Come now, Yakuma. And we all got yellow Surely eyes. What's up with that, huh? We should be friends. She's doing green face again. This is very. This is very disrespectful to Yoda's race, whatever the fuck it's called. <laughs> I can't remember what the page on Wikipedia on Wikipedia is called. Like the name is just called Yoda's species. Yeah, exactly. Well, it looks like we've avoided another fight for now, but we better not let our guard down. I am the goddess Nuwa. Creator of the Who are you? This is all this bullshit from last Isn't time, huh? But wait, I want to see what Yoko's got to say. Whoa, take take that. I'm not so easily provoked. Two adults. But I see you don't shy away from a confrontation. Oh, what's this? Very weird how it just stops being a cutscene for a second there. Further within is a transportation device. The same design as the one Bethel's trying to use. Use it to return to the God, they love this shot so fucking much. I wish I loved anything the way that SM35 loves this, this profile shot. This is so dynamic. Until we meet again. It's so funny. It's like it's a video game. You have like infinite possibilities for camera placement. But um for some reason like modern developers just have like no fucking idea what to do. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Probably heal myself and save. This game introduces kind of a weird pacing wrinkle in this game where you do like two heavy duty boss fights in a row like that. But uh, that's alright. Probably better after this starting area. Hey, what's Dazai? No, we gotta call you Pussy Mode. Are you for bullying? I love this guy. We might. He doesn't seem that interested. I know that face. Well, the the what is that you? Exactly. Come on, it's me. It's your Odazai. Whoa. The I one and only you how happy I had to see distinct you. character. But, uh, Ichiro Dazai. You do look a little different. Oh, we gotta listen to everything he has Damn. to say. Oh, I guess I explained everything <laughs> in that fade out. Cool. So who's that? It's Yoda Hiromine. Yoko Hiromine. Oh, whatever. And I can hear you. We met on the way here. I bet she hey. loves Daza. Good to see everyone. They seem like they would have good piece. chemistry. <laughs> You don't say something so fucking lame, dude. Come on. I'm trying to, I'm trying to be your shooter. And since we're all together again, I think you should. It's the guy, the guy with the sister. Yeah. Yeah. He wears his blazer open just like me. Hey. Hey. Oh, shut the fuck. Get out of here so I can use Epo and Doctor the next time they come here. Whoops, let me save. <laughs> the level scale, just completely removing the level scaling is like such a funny balance change because. It means the team, the development team, had to recognize that like there was a very fundamental flaw in their um, yeah, true. scaling. 
God damn, it's so severe. Those bullet design. Yeah. Something you probably should have caught in the testing phase, to be honest. Something you probably should have caught in the testing phase, to be honest. Looks like we'll be able to head back to the Tokyo we call home. I love that place. It's got student with afro, and uh, sometimes Goko is there. I'm the one who gets to spin the drum. And, and then, and the turbo grinding crit plus two. I really didn't realize that. At least I did something with the. Regular Tokyo. <clears throat> we arrived. <laughs> there he is. Always looks this so good in these cutscenes. Are we back in Tokyo? Oh man. <laughs> yes. This is Joey University's medical research lab. We came in here through the Bethel terminal. That's great, dude. That form just now. Explain yourself. All oh, right, you're in this cutscene too. Lab deal. Wow. No, I don't, don't remember what I said I in response to the scene first time around, but I bet it was funny as fuck. So go back and watch <laughs> the original playthrough. See what I would have had yeah. to say if I, I didn't already watched it. Answer. Bethel will have no mercy for one who violates the will of God. I should just have the fucking the original playthrough on YouTube played concurrently while we um <laughs> while we play these games. <laughs> He's like, damn, I was spitting hot fire. What the fuck? What happened? I fell off. Please forgive him. The saint. Damn, everybody's in this cutscene. Oh my god, the saint. That's right, what a meaningful uh, appellation. Unbreakable even. Then, how would you account for this? Allow the Japanese branch to look into it. Though, what I can tell you is that this is the one they lost all those years ago. Oh, nice. Wow. Yeah. I wonder what else Snoop Dogg's adventures entailed. I look it up on my phone while this cutscene was playing. Let's see. Case, Does Snoop play SMT? Probably. He probably streams it. He's probably streaming it right now and fucking Bogart and <laughs> all our viewers. Let me see. Um, other adventures. Probably nothing as funny as the porno that he did in 2000, but... I don't know. On the Japanese branch to investigate. Man, talk about scary. What's up with her? So that's the Archangel in charge of headquarters. Oh, it was you did a lot of fundraisers. Nevertheless, <laughs> not getting a lot to work with you. I think in More than this cutscene is going to be. For what? Would you mind joining uh, like today? charities and such. He hosted like a basket weed charities. He hosted a basketball fundraiser, Hoops for Water, for Flint, Michigan. So that was cool. Oh, pretty gosh. sure, that, pretty sure that situation hasn't revolved, resolved itself though. So I guess it didn't, it didn't <laughs> yeah. work. Is anyone still alive in Flint? I fucking, I hope so. Alright, let me uh. Say, probably should have skipped that cutscene because Yoko had nothing new to the table to bring. That's kind of yeah. the bad part of streaming this game twice is that uh, I don't really know <laughs> when she's gonna do anything. Oh well. Let's so talk to Daza. I guess I can't because it just brings me here to the fucking boring ass meeting room. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, what a crew. Now, where do I? Oh, I'm Yoko. Okay, let's let, let her do her bit before I start skipping. Attending school right now. We met her in this version of Tokyo that looked like a wasteland. She helped us when we were attacked by a demon. Or is this when we start to get more of like the original 
like narrative oh, scenes or I'm working with the Bethel Japanese branch and like, like should I not skip it anymore I don't, I don't know it's what's, what's up you able to fight uh -huh. against them? you'll see the good do soon strange power hmm. for a long time some have even called me a saint my potential was even recognized at school and I was taught how to exercise demons learned at school huh fascinating I'm the same way Hiromine I've had spiritual powers ever since I was little I'm using my abilities to work with the Japanese branch, just like she's I'm talking like she's reading off of her like Wikipedia blurb. But never mind that. Right <laughs> now. I should explain about that world of demons you saw. I also had spiritual powers if since I was I little. You the Tokyo you I have, I have blood type B, and I love um. <laughs> you believe me? I love takoyaki. Huh? I figured uh, this cutscene definitely seems the most distinct so far. Eighteen years ago, something happened in the Chiyoda ward of Tokyo that suddenly erased the city from the rest of Japan. Its population of over ten million people was wiped out in a matter of minutes. Tokyo only have ten million people. What are you that was more than that. So, well, like, we've been living in Tokyo as far as I can tell. Japan has like 127 million people total, and I assume that's like super concentrated in the metropolitan areas. Maybe back then it was only 10 million. Yeah, maybe. Through his miracle, Tokyo and its people were but it's not like well, it's not like the population is increasing anymore. They they peaked a, a little while ago. <laughs> An act of God, 18 years ago. Yeah, no spoilers. Uh, Tao, whose name I could barely remember just now. Fake. That's <laughs> Jesus. Out oh, Isuzu no Kami. Yeah, I remember now. It's a very distinct name, so I should I should know it. Completely overrun by demons. As if one Tokyo wasn't enough, the demons now covet the other. I have a copy oh, of of Neo. Chui, God, it's such a fucking terrible thing to say out loud. I have a copy of that game. I really need to play it still. I got a bunch of like PS4 JRPGs that I gotta get to. Not oh, cool guy. Louis. It just uh, it just sounds like you're doing like baby voice. How did he say it? Cleared things up for you. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Yeah. Hey, uh, haven't I seen you somewhere before? You should just had him look at Algami and then look at uh, the prime minister and then look at Algami and then look at the prime minister. Just do it like six times. I'm in charge here, in addition to being Japan's prime minister. <laughs> Man. This shit is pretty quaffed, it's true. Director, Koshimizu? Indeed. Glad to see you made it back. He does have the drip, I can't I can't lie. He's way more dripped out than any like real prime minister. It's best I enlighten you as to the true state of the world. To put it plainly. Like Shinzo Abe used to always just come out with this fucking this clippers jersey and his big ass basketball pants. He looked like shit, man. <laughs> Demons seek human souls. If given the chance, they would flood the real world in an instant. That's why Bethel Japan is dedicated to protecting Tokyo and keeping the demons at bay. That's cool, I like your checker. But only Tokyo. <laughs> yeah. Fuck Osaka. Fuck that. Fuck them. There's red Max over there. They speak slightly differently than us, which is crazy, dude. <laughs> in fact, Bethel's strength is so short of the mark. They use different, forced to rely on students, such as different words sometimes, like... Heard the report. So, you're a demon exorcist from St. Marina Girls High School. That place is it's called St. Marina, but I'll put in a word like a Catholic school. N no way. Is that something I could help with too, Mr. Prime Minister? You mean protecting Tokyo? Yeah, I'll do whatever I can. Yeah, Don't humans I... and demons are just. Summon each other I'm in uh, from soft games instead of school. whatever they're doing right now. He's making trouble for other people, but even a guy like me wants to be someone people can turn to. Wow, that's how I felt when I was a teenager. I was always like, dude, I wish fucking people would turn to me every now and then. <laughs> I've heard about you, so you fused with Algami. Is that it? I'll be asking for your cooperation as well. Sorry, but I won't take no for an answer. I like that Koshi Mizu has like, he's like incapable of saying anything that isn't like super snide. He has like one emotional register. And it's uh, very consistent. I never signed up with this man. I understand, but you have no 
choice. Like he's a fucking Vietnam veteran. <laughs> you as well, Hiromine. Would you lend us your demon exercising abilities? If I can operate alongside him, then I'll do it. I have no objections. Thank you. It's true, everybody else here is kind of a dildo. I'm thankful the proto fiend returned safely. Though I've never heard of it fusing with a human before. I played a role in Algami's creation myself. I'll be running a variety of tests. Proto fiend. Algami, I'd like to examine your memory data. Make your way to the research facility later today. Understood. I'll visit with the rest of you some other time. For now, I want you to go home and get some rest. Sir! And lastly, user. You gotta try to like connect with these kids a little bit. Instead of saying like that, you should just be like, oh, right. Uh, next mission, catch some Z's. <laughs> some shit like that. <laughs> Your summoning skills must have improved. I'll be sure to grant you an even stronger Your summoning next skills must have improved. <laughs> the fuck did he say? <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yeah, it's true. You should get some fucking. The, the diet should just be like pumping out um, TikToks at this point. Alright, I gotta I gotta use the men's bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. Gotcha. My house, my house has a men's bathroom in. <laughs> no, I'll be, I'll be right back. <laughs> Alright, good luck. Speed and good luck. In the Skibbity Abbey. Hey, hello, Tay. What's up? So I have to use the little boy's room. Alright, that was a healthy stream, so it looks like I'll make it through the winter after all. Alright, what I Excellent. What are we doing here? Dude. Hey, what's up? How's it going? To protect Tokyo? How cool is that? I remember that line reading. I'm gonna be fighting alongside <clears throat> all those big names at school. Me. Me? <laughs> so fucking cool. God damn it. <laughs> the big reason I don't do all that well in school is because honestly. I'm just not very confident in myself. Yeah, this is a very Even funny um scene where he just tells you everything really about his character arc that's coming up. So I guess I've always just been looking for a way to fix things. But if I side with my dad, my mom gets all pissed. <clears throat> and it's the same for like, my this old is man ridiculous. If I side with my mom. I don't know what's right anymore. Protecting Tokyo from demons though? That's gotta be a good thing. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Wow, dude. Dude. I get to protect. I can relate to this character. Man. My high school troubles are not unlike his high school troubles. <laughs> I should apologize for hiding the fact that I was involved with Bethel. Dude, we gotta wrap this stream up. I got another day of, of high school tomorrow. <laughs> I gotta get up early. So I can study maths. Like a European. <laughs> I didn't want to get you involved. But... I also didn't think the situation would become as dire as it is now. What are they gonna make an SMT game where all the characters are just like 30 year old pieces of shit? I'm glad we're both alright. Let's work together to keep Tokyo safe. I guess never. It's always sunny in Tokyo. Pretty much, yeah. I gotta talk to Yoko, excuse so me. This is the Bethel Japanese branch. And Lux, I'm relieved we were able to escape the Netherworld. I'm relieved we- Why, you don't want to tell me your entire backstory? What's wrong with you guys? Only Dazai knows what's up, I guess. Hmm. <clears throat> you the Swagmeisters at school. All the- all the big names that were swag Swagmeisters. <laughs> like, freaking Yuzuru Atsuda? <laughs> Atsuda? <laughs> what the fuck is <laughs> Ugh. <clears throat> 
Hold on, I'm gonna gargle him. Gotcha. <laughs> Whoa. I'll mute my mic. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, this is the virtual battle thing? No. Uh. <clears throat> virtual trainer allows you to challenge past foes. Cool. This looks some sort of optional challenge mode. <laughs> it's really long. Oh, no, it's not. It's not as long as I thought it was. So I'll probably do that off stream, yeah, I guess. This should good for grinding. Yeah. Is there any reason that I would do that all on screen, or can I just do that? We should probably head back. Do that later. We've got school tomorrow. Speaking of which, what about her? Like a cool virtual background, maybe. That's like a wireframe. It's kind of bluish. I should get going as well. I'll see you later. Yeah, it's nothing that cool. Yeah, I'll be right so. back. Gotcha. Right. You get a game over if you die in, in virtual. If you die in a virtual battler, I guess you die in real life. It is cool that they have that feature, though. Every game should. I mean, like Strange Journey had a boss rush. So I don't know why. Like it's taking so long to get one again. That was always a really good way to grind in Strange Journey. It's fighting every boss in the game. Hello. Oh, you're tutorialing me. Oh, you're a quest. Okay, so they actually added quests in the real world. That's cool. You know what? I, I guess I'll take on your quest. I'm not going to do it on stream, but... I realize that's always been your dream to see a demon with Mahama or whatever. Whatever you're asking me, I wasn't reading. I did. I wanted to tell you I got... Oh, man, you gotta mute your eye. You gotta mute your mic, man. <laughs> Oh well, just ignore that I guess, because I don't know how to mute, <laughs> mute him individually. I have uh, PVC on. Um, woman probably not Very saying anything. I'll, I'll just talk while they're talking, so you can't hear it. <laughs> yeah, so basically this is nearby resident. Uh, he's asking me about some bullshit. Oh, it's Jack Frost, cool. Yeah, I, want, I wanted to just do something like that, but I, then I wouldn't know like when he came back. So I'm just going to leave it for now. Do you get quests for the VR battler? Oh man. It's going to be a pain in the ass. Well, if it's just demons from the creation play uh, scenario, that's not that bad. Yeah, Are you talking about the SMT if manga? I don't know what the hell you're talking about. SM SMT con, whatever the hell it's called. I haven't read it. I guess I should. I gotta read all the paraphernalia. Damn, what a bummer. Uh, maybe I'll just look that quest up and see. Well, I don't think there's, like, detailed uh, FAQs for this game yet. Oops. Right, well, I'm going to the dorm. Good old dormitory. Oh, wait, does this just bring me right here? Okay. You got nothing interesting to say, man in suit. Just what I would expect from a man in suit. They're just talking about the cave and still. It's not interesting. This guy too, of course. They're more sprawling than I remember it being. This, uh, this little world map. I am mode two. Sure thing, buddy. They call me the quiz master. 
I did all the quizzes in the Persona 4 quiz side quest. Demon Onmora, why do you know about this shit? They're asking me demon questions. I don't know about this. Dude, come on. Wait, what? Did I just select the wrong one? Well, oh, that was a name in the compendium entry. That oh, was a cocker demon. Sorry. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Nah, it's good. Welcome back. We're doing a quiz right now. I don't know shit about Advars, actually. You probably shouldn't flood your house. I'm guessing light a candle. The other ones seem kind of insane. Yeah, happy one hour, everybody. I, I still haven't come up with a good name for the streaming knowledge community. <laughs> yeah. I think one. I think at one point I just wanted to call call them deadheads, just because that's the best one, and I don't care if it um makes sense. Because <laughs> I already <laughs> Grateful Dead already took the, the only good one, so. And Jerry Garcia is dead anyway. Yeah. Fuck. That. What are we fucking Jerry Bear's estate is gonna sue us? I fucking doubt it. Right, here we go. We got a, another Perry app. Classic occult research club activities. I wish there was an occult research club in my high school. Yeah, that'd be neat. My high school doesn't even fucking exist anymore. I think they shut it down like a couple of years ago. Seriously? <laughs> yeah. It was uh, it was really struggling a few years after I uh, I graduated there. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah, mine has mine has a different name now. Yeah, that makes sense. Was it named after some sort of a prep school, some sort of racist man, <laughs> or something? Or... No, it was just yeah, okay. I was gonna say it'd be branding. I was gonna say it'd be very funny if they also had places named after Confederate generals up there, like they do down here. It'd be very confusing. Yeah, they don't. Man, we gotta do. Uh, uh, not Maryland. No carpet baggers. I wanted to to keep the the dream alive, I guess. Or reverse carpet baggers. I don't know what the hell you would call it. I like this old school Japanese man, though. Yeah, oh, this is the epic Nocturne reference. Yo, Nocturne heads, don't you feel seen right now? <laughs> wow. All right. I get their reference. I guess that change.org petition to include an epic Nocturne reference to the next SMT game paid off after all. Oh, wait, I went to go to the roof, not my room. I'm not, not going to get to see a student with Afro now. Oh, wait, they... You actually have a room now? That's interesting. And you're glowing, too. And I'm, and I'm green like my hero Yoda. Holy shit, dude. <laughs> this is ectoplasm. This is, this is pretty bad. I'm trying to get him in an angle where he's not doing this. What the fuck? <laughs> God, this sucks. I like my little nerd quills on my my hangers up there. It's, it's good. Mountain Dew Abino. Goddamn. Downloadable content soccer. What? We're not high enough level to do that, I assume. Probably not. I'm chronicle my deeds. It just put a terminal in my fucking. Get the dog in a park now, too. Yeah. You know what my favorite part of the new dorm room is that it really expresses my individuality as the protagonist. <laughs> I got some. I got, a, got some books because you know this bad boy be reading. Um, I got a laptop. I prob probably watch you screw and jizz hub and whatever the fuck <laughs> they, whatever like non-brand name porn sites they have in the smt5 world screw hub 
Skyrim's pretty good. Or just hub. It's pretty good. Uh, I can't go to my the roof. There's no one in the area. Whatever. I'd like to cast something to get rid of the green shit in here. Jeez. Alright, is there a calendar in this room? Let's see. Nope, just this mirror that doesn't reflect me. This is like a prison cell with this fucking mirror. Jeez. I only get out of here so I can stop looking at the bioluminescence. <laughs> it's time for bed. Oh, I'm still, I'm still shining. I still got it. Even as I read wow. my, my copy of the Mon Yoshi. Is that really a copy of the Mon Yoshi? Because the Mon Yoshi was like 500 pages. That was like a pamphlet. Maybe he's reading the Mon Yoshu for dummies or something, I don't know. Did you know? We're thriving on that green All energy the out here. Is this cutscene supposed to look like this? I'm having lore knowledge? I mean, dreams? However, this is very important. The gods were stripped away and settled instead into the paltry souls of humanity. Okay. Hence, the gods no longer possess the capacity for. Creation. So, is this here because in the Vengeance canon they like don't have the same cutscenes that would have served as expository dialogue or. I don't know, this it is, is the law. This, yeah, is, this is the try not to come challenge team, so you gotta skip this. Yeah, I don't uh In this world the god of This cutscene really supposed to look like this? This is just fucking blinding oh, no. white? And to thrive. It's really bad. This is the first low low of the cutscene. But his so called order is nothing more than a Not like this? Okay. Alright, sorry. For anybody who has to look look at this, then had true freedom. I was gonna say this is a very bold move to have it look this fucked up. There are none who stand closer to this is the bold version. Man. You must learn the true shape. I can barely try not to come when they look like this. This is ridiculous. It is imperative that your eyes be open. Jeez, this is rough to look at, man. Alright, well thank you for closing my eyes while saying that. <laughs> You're saying that blazing white light was actually the essence of man after all? Damn. Alright, well now we're... In our very, for school. our very green school. Imagine if you saw someone just fucking running like this in the courtyard, you'd be like, "What the fuck is wrong with this nerd?" <laughs> right, let's see. <laughs> uh, okay, you stretch. Nah, I like to be a big dickhead for no reason. So, do you want to do Laura Chaos for this route? Uh. Which one is more interesting? Which one has more original content? I guess I don't. It was basically the same for either one. I don't well, really know how it works. Law does. <clears throat> law does. I guess we'll do law. I guess we'll, me and my boy Mastema are gonna fucking gonna be tight. You, you put him on chaos though. Tiamat's on chaos. He said. Yeah. And you fight who is, I, I guess the fucking whatever it's called. The, right, you know, Mastermind on Chaos. And, oh, Mastermind on Chaos. The new boss on Law. Okay, that's okay. That's yeah. I would rather just fight the new guy then. All right. I've already been choosing all the Law and the Chaos choices. Though, so I'm kind of fucked. I'm kind of fucked up right now. See ya. There's still plenty of time. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't notice until we played it on stream, but 
uh, they really like like to condense all the dialogue into um into these interstitial scenes before uh before you get to the new colored desert. Uh... <sighs> oh, you guys are as cool as always. You fight Tiamat either route. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, that's what I was thinking about. I was thinking of set to home. Well, that's a way better that boss than just Mastema, who, who I fought fucking three times already. Come on, buddy. Bullying. <sighs> no way. Man, what is she talking about? But whoa, dude, this is like massaging the themes of this arc. This game, this game has narrative fundamentals. Up the up the wazoo, if I do say so myself. Pardon my French, but the wazoo on this game. <laughs> Let's get out of here. What is this poster? This is an anti-bullying poster. That would have been a really good touch. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> I'm sure it's nothing. <laughs> oh, it's the coffee guy. You you rock, dude. Let's post your dialogue on Twitter and get 15,000 likes. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> there she is. She's being bull they, they really couldn't have given, like, the bullies models. I don't know, this is a very... I can't this is a stylistic her. choice that doesn't pay off do in a lot of ways. Nope. I can't wait to see her break down in tears. I'm a bully, I can't wait till my victim cries. <laughs> <laughs> I love it when a bully and victim's first line of dialogue is why me. Gives me a good understanding of the, di the dynamic the dynamics at play. Yeah, it's very funny going like straight from the supernatural apocalyptic uh, shit of the, the first arc into this. And it's just like, uh oh, couple at school. <laughs> Yes, let's see. It's still just as good as it was three years ago. Have they made like has 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 the Bullion arc survived mostly intact, or is it like fundamentally different in the Avengers? A little different, run? yeah. All right, well, that's good. Mm -hmm. They can't they can't have made it worse. So that's something to look yeah, forward true. to. <laughs> Sure thing, I'm trying to get the law ending so I can see more content. Uh. <laughs> Remember that dream Tao was talking about the other day? It hey, you might as well do this. Uh, this quest. Oh, this is a quest? Whoa, they're fleshing out the character of Miyazu now. <laughs> Not really. Wait, this is just the same shit. Yeah, I think I think it would just be about the Konsu shit. I guess it's cool that they're setting it up earlier this time instead of just making it like an end end game side quest. But but the prince yeah. wasn't riding the typical white horse and all that, and it's weird. On the days when I have that dream, I always wake up feeling a little less. Ever since I remembered it, I can't seem to get the prince out of my head. Oh yeah, what this is the. Just a dream. Fucking Jeffrey Epstein <laughs> subplot. It's forgot. It's oh. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. A vision. Consul on Epstein Island. Exactly. <laughs> Noah's ass is in there getting fucking put massages with uh with Matt Greening. But I don't know the first thing about <laughs> that, that was a plane, excuse me. <laughs> so I didn't mean to slander Matt Greening. <laughs> so he went there too? 
he was on a plane with Epstein and he got like foot massages from like a teenage girl and I think that, I think that was it. But I feel like if that happened, then probably some other extremely fucked up shit happened. So I don't know if, I don't know if I'm willing to just leave it at that. What's the? T oh my god. Some quest up restrictions. Oh, this one's simple. All right, it's good. This quest is only available for. All right, links for the heads up. Oh, did I press B? Excuse me. I'll try to look in. I hope I can talk to her again. Okay, yeah. <laughs> You're not here to. Oh, really? Yeah, it's Thank weird. So They're much. saying when they found Epstein's body in his um in his prison cell that it was prepared uh, as if he was going off on a voyage of kings. It was very very strange. <laughs> I love that the additional characterization from Yazu is that she's very, she's very, very sickly. Sorry I'm imposing on you so much, but I hope you can help me. Class. Yeah, besides Epstein and his jail cell were, were everything you would need in the afterlife. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they found the copy of uh, the Book of Going Forth by Day <laughs> in his prison cell. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, like, fuck, this dude better not be slaying a uh, uh, pep in the, in the underworld right now. <laughs> I'm gonna be so pissed off. Mm. Oh, wait, are we talking to you about the quest? I didn't realize. Yeah. Actually, I actually don't know what we're supposed to be doing right now, because I wasn't listening to what she was saying. Show you. Just go for it with the, with the uh, main quest. Oh, gotcha. He's, he's serious and more stubborn than most, but... Dude, I wish I had a dying little sister when I was in high school. <laughs> then I could then I could have been one of the big names of the school. <laughs> Morning, man. Nice being back home again, huh? Me? Second I'm floor. Okay, I wasn't reading that. Big lecture about how this demon summoning stuff works. And the Bethel guys even said I've got this natural talent for it. <laughs> that seems unlikely. That? I'm a demon summoner. That means I can protect people. Like a real hero. So, I'm gonna give this all I got. I wonder what natural talent for summoning even means. I'm just imagining them just like pressing the button on the hey, comp now. and Sorry then <laughs> like ya. Obarion comes out and the scientist that's yeah. watching them is like, Whoa, you're like super good at this. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you hiding? Nice button press. Yeah. <laughs> Your menu skills are fucking insane. <laughs> This guy was just hanging out, huh? Oh, you know. Cool, man. Perhaps I should talk to one more student before I go. <sighs> You're just saying the same shit as last time. These guys are t t fucking bad mouthing Dazai. We should kill him. <laughs> Alphys, use Mazan on these two. What are they called? Male student A and male student B, please. <sighs> Some Cyan, Cyan students out here. Cyan student. <laughs> Alright, no more students. Yeah, I've had enough of these Long guys. Thing. I assume one of these. Wait. Is one of them marked for the quest? I don't, I don't care. Yeah, hey, you can't do it yet. It's continuing with our quest, I guess. Yeah, like, I'm a third year student, so I'm glad that other students are telling me like where things are in the school, because I haven't figured it out yet. It's every day for two years, you walk, in, walk into the, the school building and just fucking look around like, what the fuck? Yeah, this is a maze! <laughs> <laughs> They are hating. They're just haters. That's all there is to it, frankly. Right. Male student A Boys, and male student B. They just wish they had names, like first names and last names and stuff. Good morning, everyone. 
Today we have a transfer student joining our class. Like he couldn't give this teacher the this face. This is Yoko Hiromine. Why is she just still wearing her old school uniform? Yeah, it's weird. It's a pleasure to meet you all. I hope we get along. They could have, uh, I don't know, you'd just be wearing like a generic blouse or something. today, she is a fellow student, so help her out with whatever she may need. Oh, that's a meaningful exchange. We haven't learned about the Zeus consent thing yet. I think that's gonna be later on, because he's like level 60. But I'm looking forward to that so I can answer that ask and be like, yeah, it was pretty fucked up. That's it for today, everyone. All rise. Thank you, sir. Gary, you weren't even paying attention to your chalk tablet or whatever the fuck that thing is. Maybe just a regular tablet. I don't know. I transferred over here since we'll be working together for a while. Cool. You can't see. Yeah. Well, I don't know why it was. It just like simulates myopia if you don't uh. You don't press the down or up button. It's a pleasure, Bethel. Um, I guess this is the, the nice boy law answer. Likewise, I'll be counting on you and Algami quite a bit here. And of course, I'm here to help you as well. So if you need anything, let me know. Well, anyway, what? what would I need? I would have loved to walk home. You're the new student. <laughs> but apparently, I have to talk to some teachers. I'll see you later, okay? Take care. Yeah, this mysterious transfer student is actually like a new character in the game that they made just for this game, just this new scenario. It's like a new thing that they're doing. It's kind of crazy and new. <laughs> <laughs> Brand new. They should have a big red sticker on the case, on the vengeance case, like in the corner that just says NEW! <laughs> New transfer student. Yeah. Hey. Or new Todd mode. <laughs> Todd mode two baby is coming back. <sighs> Don't worry. Sometimes she acts quite flippant and um, a little bit dismissive of other people's feelings, which I'm sure will snowball in a really realistic way as the game regresses. Hey Alright, head out the class classroom go down the hall. But they have new dialogue about the transfer student, Yoko Hiromi. <laughs> hey. Hey. We gotta talk to all of them just in case they say something like super funny. Oh. No friggin' way. Head left, yeah. Yeah. I haven't seen any new Star Wars stuff at all, really. I need to get back on the Star Wars bandwagon because it's always funny to talk about like anything Star I have, Wars I related. <laughs> nice. Look, Which one was the acolyte new? Acolyte would so so. What was the new one? Not right now. Uh, the acolyte. Oh, that's, that's right. Time. Yeah. What is that even about? Is that about like an existing character? Is it new? New cast? About the High Republic. Well, that's cool. From, uh, 100 years before the Phantom Menace. Oh, uh, gotcha. So you know that bad boy's got a lot of CGI background. Like a crime mystery show. Oh really? I didn't realize that. Thanks. But I can't really talk about it at school. I'm looking forward to Skulls and Crew Gro coming out this December. Is that the one that's like inexplicably like an eighties movie? Like a Goonie style eighties movie? Like it's eighties Star Wars kids show. Yeah, I watched the trailer and they had a scene where they were literally going through like an 80s suburb, but it's Star Wars. Yeah, so. there's a suburb, Star Wars suburb, which is pretty weird. That's pretty funny. Oh, you know. Head all the way down the hall. Gotcha. I guess I'll stop talking to these jagged students. I thought you said, oh, oh, you said down the hallway. Fuck, I thought you meant downstairs. Hold up, new scene with. Sorry. Oh, um, oh, that wasn't anything. Hi there. 
can't. I can't. I got my glasses off. Can't see shit. Not a feeling. This seems like a meaningless choice. I guess I'll ask how she's feeling because I'm a good boy. Oh no, nothing's wrong with me. Itsukishima was hurt, so I just wanted to help a little. The nurse is out for the day. So Wonder how they select like the writing crew for the new Star Wars series. Um, is it just like nepotism, or do they have to have like actually worked on things before? It always feels they like, usually do. It always feels like the showrunner has like, like five weird credits, especially for Andor, which is the best so far. Yeah, that was somebody who like actually worked in like serious drama before. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I missed all that because I was thinking about Star Wars, the exciting Star Wars extended universe. I wish I could help. Head back upstairs. What is there? Is there a hot ass nurse in this room? No. Nope. Yeah, I guess only Persona One has the the fucking babe nurse. Let's go back upstairs. Head left. Yep. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Yeah, I was going the right way. Stop. 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 Did I speak up more? I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it through the wall. Wow, it's pretty far away. What is it? What's wrong with you? This is Jagoff. Hmm. Yeah, I kind of doubt that, like... The Obi Wan show was written by a person. I think they just have like a board or something that they uh mm -hmm. they have to write like the lesser Star Wars shows. Yeah, that one was so so. It looked really bad. Book above that. Yeah. But I kind of like all of them though. Damn. You're an, ex I'm a sucker. You're an exemplary Star Wars fan. <laughs> I'm a Star Wars consumer. Hell yeah. I mean, where I'm, where I'm sitting right now, I'm literally surrounded by Star Wars figures, so... That's right, yeah. Would you care to pick one of them up and then make, like, laser noises? The stream? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, no, because I have them on display very carefully. Ah, uh, damn. That's a bummer about being an adult. You can't play with your figures anymore. And have awesome adventures with your, uh... I do have a Dio figure, too. Yeah, oh, nice. I said I'm Ronnie James Dio. Oh, okay. That's also good. Not Dio Brando. It's actually better, honestly. <laughs> Maybe he has a laser pistol, too. <laughs> Pretty good. Uh, is there anything good after the original series? The Gendy... Gendy Tartakovsky... Tarkovsky. I can't fuck it. I can never remember how to say his name. The original like story, Clone Wars cartoon is really good. And apparently uh, yes, Andor is good. Watchable. Yeah. Hmm. The, the newer Clone Wars though is very important for the rest of the series. I've heard that. Like for the um all the, all the new stuff. That'll be a, a Shoko show and all that shit. So you have to watch a five season cartoon if you'd like to get everything out of. <laughs> uh, that seems like an insane. I'm watching that Decision. It's for a Star Wars fan. It's worth watching. I've heard it's pretty good, actually. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What do I report for this quest? Or it just said quest completed. I don't know. I'm being blocked by these these ladies. So. Yeah, talk to me, Azu. When you're done. Yeah. I wish I could help. We wasted way too much fucking time in this school. Holy shit! We need to. Get the, the move on. That's amazing. Well, I never knew Egyptian mythology had a god like that. A, g a god of the moon? A prequel's so god, you say? So Fascinating. I didn't expect you'd find a myth that matched. I mean, yeah, I've so I have nostalgia for those movies, but. <clears throat> I definitely I grew up like the during moon. the uh, the prequels era, even though I didn't actually watch them when I was a kid. So that was I definitely like formed my idea of what Star Wars was uh, coming up. But um, feels like turns out there was a lot of scenes where they're just in like a council and talking about like, like moral responsibility, <laughs> and then um 
Then they go, then they go to a, a fucking 60s diner at some point. I don't know, I would have been very confused if I had yeah. watched it as a kid, I think. My health's always been too fragile to travel I still like the Fedemix a lot. It's definitely one of the least bad ones. I bet the sun feels brighter there. I can't even imagine how the air must The boss is the attack of the clones. Every fucking time Miyazaki was on screen, we just talk about Star Wars. <laughs> to me, it may as well be another world. It's fine. Oh my god. Wait, something feels and kind of literally weird. nothing to say about her. So there really isn't. Yeah. <laughs> In the story, Konsu saves the princess of another country. She's just right? she's just doing the thing where they explain the myth so you can understand like Not the themes princess. of her, her side close. quest. Prince from the moon. Then again, I'm probably overthinking this anyway. It's just a dream. I mean, it's good that they added this, so this isn't just like a non sequitur like it is in the game. But maybe we yeah, have, we definitely have, needed. Yeah, we got plot to do though. So come on, Miyazaki. This isn't much, but you deserve something for all that. I hope they get like voice actors that know how to talk like human beings in the, in the next game. <laughs> Because I kind of just hate the way everybody speaks in this game, except for uh, Koshimizu and Daza, because they're hilarious. But, um... Yeah. Yeah. The robot kids. Oh. It's just like a very... Oh, let's get the fuck out of here. A very even let's time. Go. Yeah, we'll just go. She's talking about anime, though. <laughs> recorded it for me. First, for sex. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. Look at all these students we can talk to! <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no! no. no. Where, where no. am I supposed to go to, though? No. Oh, no, I'm just supposed to leave the school, okay. Yeah. I feel like it was pretty good in in uh, yes, SMT4. Was... I like um, Wasn't it? Walter and Jonathan's voice in... Uh, yeah, they were pretty good. Uh, Tag Tagama, he was good. He sounded like a real scumbag. It feels like a real step down. Step, a real step down, despite this game actually having like cut scenes with choreography and shit, where it would have um been of greater benefit. I just don't know if it was right. He was an ordinary student with an ordinary life, and now I've drawn him into this conflict. He's a soldier in this war now. I chose to fight. He didn't ask for this. Not just him. I drove you into this as well. If I'd been more capable. More powerful. At least they made you sort of I could have handled this on my own. kind of think about what happened in the plot in this scene. That's cool. To be stronger, I'll have to do my part on the front lines, especially now that we have new more than ever before. Yeah, for sure. I'll make sure Tokyo stays safe. I save Tokyo. Let's get out of here. But fuck Osaka and Kyoto. <laughs> oh yeah, it don't matter at all. Fuck all those places. Yo. The Ryukyu Islands? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> They're not Eastern Japan, so they don't matter at all. Yeah, 4 did have the Kanako particles. That's a good way of putting it. Even though they spin it into like a bunch of nonsense that completely falls apart if you think about it for longer than like 13 seconds. Wow, this now what's is, going on with Project Mask? This looks pretty good. I don't know, I don't really know anything about the plot other than that girl has like the same design as the girl from the Alice in Wonderland NFT thing. But with pink hair, so I, I don't know if it's related. This looks really good. I'm gonna reload the save. Cause, uh, <laughs> can't fucking see where I'm going. I did save. I, don't know, I saved. Yeah, it says six o'clock. Yeah, there's certain, there's definitely like a certain tenor to like modern anime JRPG uh, voice acting. This, I, I can see stuff at least, so I guess let's go to the event, event flag.
Storm roof, baby. Hope it's as white as it is there. As it is here. I guess I said that wrong. I hope the turbo granting quest isn't right now, because we're not going to be able to fucking find her. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's around level 20-ish. Hmm. Let's see. We should be able to do it now. What? How'd you know? I talked to all the NPCs. That's all I know. <laughs> yeah. I'm worried about her. So Hori's a friend. Well. Project Mask isn't actually like an NFT thing, is it? Is it even like a Bitcoin thing, or is it just by a Bitcoin developer? She's being bullied. They're definitely not NFTs. Yeah, we're we're such a great yeah. player. We don't know a whole lot, yeah. But she had to quit last year after a big accident. And that's when all this started. Yeah, the fact that it's a gotcha is like bad enough. The old club members, they really resented her. A few people quit because Sahori's training regimen was just she just wanted to make sure we were the best team basically they quit because they were like a bunch of pussies they didn't they didn't want to they didn't want to win enough they didn't have the hunger you think there's anything i can do to help but be a little tattled too i don't know which i don't even know what um like ideology either one of these are communicating I it's guess tell, tell the teacher is obviously the law one because it's being a little uh, being a little wiener. But these choices don't matter, like as far as how the plot I unfolds. So. That, but mm. Well, these do. The, the big ones do. Herself. Wait, like it actually changes what happens yeah. in the plot, or does it just give you law no, and chaos points? Like, that's what I yeah. Something ironclad, like evidence or statement, and if she won't talk, you yeah, video games with every year they just become increasingly uh more and more naked sorry. <laughs> it's like slot machines it's I pretty cool to eavesdrop on you so like oh, it was here all, the, all along was yeah you're so awesome are you are you the reason student with afro isn't okay. hanging out here anymore apologies i'll be on my way just get him off that's not cool man where the hell am i gonna talk to her Yeah, that's ridiculous. That implies that characters the characters do not have like functioning um peripheral vision. Whatever it is, I'll listen. There's no sense talking to the teachers, and passive support is just useless. Teachers just don't understand. You're thinking in half measures. If you want to a friend, that won't be enough. The only real it's this composition again. Did you like it the other four times? You'll love it this time. You really want to help? Even better with the good one. They got a son and everything. Wait, this is like a r ridiculous escalation. We don't even know about like the fact that the supernatural is going to be involved later. Like this character is fucking insane. So she's like just a psychopath. That's when trapped in the cycle, really interesting choice. Abuse only one <laughs> Not even like we should beat their asses. Like no, just kill them. Kill them. Hiromine, that... This is awesome. I'm glad I didn't spoil myself too much on this game, <laughs> so I can I'm sorry, get to learn about this in real time. Wasn't my place to say. I just thought you didn't like cars or whatever. Yeah. That's coming up. Jesus Christ. Yeah, it wasn't like profound. It was just like a school shooter kind of thing to say. Um, thanks for listening to me. I'm... I'm gonna think about it. The soon. killing bullies part, at least. I don't. The other part was just like, oh, support systems. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty funny. I appreciate any, like, 
narrative choices they made in this game to make it even more unintentionally funny, because that was the big thing in uh, SMT5's favor, the original version, so I'm perfectly fine with them doubling down on that. <laughs> no. Writing is still the album's bugaboo. Oh man, it's all so good. I wonder how the wonder how the writing and metaphor will be. I bet it's gonna be. It's gonna make um, fucking uh, Ulysses look like uh, like Doctor Zeus shit. It's gonna be so fucking good. You're gonna wanna, <laughs> you're gonna blow your head off how good it is. <laughs> Gonna redefine RPG. Yeah. You're gonna look back on like the other 200 uh, JRPGs you played and you're be like, what? This was all dog shit. <laughs> Commence. Oh, this is the goose scene. Hell yeah. I'm glad they didn't cut this out. Compiling data on the proto feed. I've heard her being called like the Shadow of the Hedgehog of the game, and it, I thought it was like more of an exaggeration, but it's pretty spot on. Analysis complete. Looks like we are picking up traces of our target. The corrupted areas have also been properly restored. I'd love the going in the the Bethel Japan goo. Oh yeah, there's a lot of like fantasy racism in Metaphor. Also, the emulator. Oh nope, it's good. It's yeah. I froze. Yeah, the fantasy racism stuff is gonna be probably handled with like a super deft hand. It's gonna be like su surprisingly intellectual and profound, and uh, you're gonna come probably. <laughs> the blasphemous might. <laughs> Guarantee. <laughs> I don't know where this power is the line from, but I trust you'll come to our aid, brother. Came from the Kojiki, probably, right? That's why you can use the. That's gonna be a Ashina quote on the box. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you're gonna come. It's gonna happen. Whether you like it or not, you're gonna come. <laughs> Yeah, that is the thing, since they're at least doing, um, like, a fantasy setting. Um, they can't, like, literally talk about how, like, the Chinese are invading Nikabukuro or whatever. Bro. Unless there's, like, a fantasy Chinatown-style setting, and then the backstory is that it used to not be like this, but now it's like this, and it's bad now. <laughs> but I don't know, I don't... I'm not counting on it. Whoa, this looks good too. Now it sucks. Oh man, this uh, well, this is oh. like watchable at least. Oh, there she is. Cry and flee, scream for me. I'm for boobs. She's literally yes. like a, a Disney villain with the shit that she says. <laughs> oh hey, cool. Killed you a million times. Great, this is gonna be fun. Is she not weak to physical skills anymore? No, she still is. Oh well. I have, I have a good, good feeling about this. this. Uh, yeah. That's a fun little ball. Yeah, that line reading was ridiculous. <laughs> it is cool that there's a fight in this uh, train station. Be serious. You just do that <laughs> fruity little move to try to become I hope you know, I didn't realize that. Young man. So what the fuck was Algami I guess we just saw what he was doing, he was in the goo, but I don't know. <laughs> it's still very funny. He was taking a little bit of Algami time for himself, yeah. Well, that was an interesting cutscene.
Oh, we gotta fight him together. Um, Such a lust for revenge. Oh! Yo, thank you for the follow. I am sorry that the like message thing was blocked by the screen. I need to <laughs> figure that out. All right, let's um. Oh boy, level 22, 21. We are missing our third slot, so that's good. I don't think we have anything good to fill it with either, so. Uh, Boss is weak to elect. Okay, well. Yoko was the only one who had Zio, so this is not looking good. Do you have elect gems or shards? We do, but... Hmm. I assume we want to kill Gla Glossia first. I feel like we're just gonna die. I don't know. It shouldn't matter. Whoops. Go after her first. I'll get... Oh, she doesn't have that much HP, actually. Alright, well. It's good to me. Just keep doing your one attack until you have to use the, uh, I guess. Oh, hell yeah, we have to watch this animation again! Dude. Oh man. Oh, health is turned against us. He Ooh. came. That was looking bad. Oh. Health is goon. Health is dude. Get your wings out of your. whatever the fuck you call those trousers. I probably should have done that on the angel first. Well, you got Pacha. Ah, oh, that's good. Oof. It was really hard. All oh, right, but she can use Mudo too. This is going super good. All right, let's lay on the offense for her at least, so we can do something. I don't know. Yeah. There you go, bud. Get Raccoon to honor too. Happy birthday. Is it, is it your birthday? Happy birthday. In that case, I'm not gonna sing the song, cause then, um... People who own the copyright to that are gonna fucking destroy us if we do. <laughs> is it has it? expired. Has it? Alright. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. I was gonna say, has anybody ever gotten DMCA'd for saying the happy birthday song? But I guess not. Wanna try it now? No, I'm good. I don't actually wanna sing anything. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. My, my throat's pretty off tonight. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> it's going to be tough. Happy birthday, dear. Whose birthday is it? Why don't you do that on side? Oh, the Pizza Cotto, apparently. We're going to die because I forgot birthday, to Happy birthday, Pizza Cotto. Happy get... birthday to you. Dude, it's like we had Mar Marilyn Monroe on stream right now. So I hope, <laughs> hope that didn't make anybody come. <laughs> We gotta start healing her again. I mean, him. Um. So try not to die in that challenge. Yeah. Yeah, we have four stampers. I'm just gonna kill them off if I can. You're done. Um. Oh, you're weak to Zio, right? I guess we should debuff him before we... Wait, are we both debuffed all the way? Holy shit, this sucks. And he's Magatsui'd, so... Push that maneuver. I'm gonna guard... Oh, is he the one who uses force? Alright, let's just do that. That little fucking attention I've been paying. <laughs> I've been using physical attacks on the uh... This You you gotta stay up, man. You should summon someone else too, so you have more press turns. Oh, true. Yeah. So we're not we're not gonna be using um darkness skills anymore. So that means unicorn can come out to play. Let's go. Um, yeah, heal alphas, please. Did you pass that turn?
Uh, we've almost lost our debuffs, so after this we can go whole hog on his ass. I didn't really need to do anything, huh? Yeah, I think that's a good thing. Alright, come on, bud. I to see him. I guess he would want to front load it. To, uh, since. I mean, I guess that's just games in general, as they front load most of the. like, distinct, meaningful mechanical content. Just because, like. Because I know most people won't see him. Yeah, most people are not going to play the game all the way to the end. Which, you know, like, trophy and achievement statistics bear that out in, like, a really... A way that, a way that must be, like, really depressing for developers. Yeah. Like, 90, 95, only 95% of the players press start at the title screen. <laughs> yeah. It's not surprising with, like, Steam, where... For some reason, people just buy hundreds of games without ever playing them because they got like a good, yeah. good deal. But uh, it must suck on other other consoles. You missed the tag, I guess. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah, I actually don't have as much sympathy if it's like a seventy-hour game, to be honest. But oh well. You're gonna miss, so let's give it to Todd. Take it away, Fortuna. Man, that wasn't bad at all. <laughs> this life spring do increases max. Oh, I don't think we need that additional 12 HP on you, so we're just gonna fuse you. Oh, it's still purple. Or lavender. Nice ass shot. Ugh, that's but twice now you've bested me. If you still haven't come and you're watching the stream, then dude, you are a like, trooper. My god. But as much as I desire a long chat with you. So we got the We got the oh, what the fuck is her name? Holy right. shit, the the sexy we'll angel lady. Oh my god. I can't remember her name. <laughs> Jophiel? Abdiel. Abdiel, yeah. Because we got the Abdiel ass shot, we got the Nama ass shot. Hmm, but we had Nua earlier. It appears we were too there she is. You Look at these nerds. Drove Nama away then. It's good to hear she vlog. It's good to be loud and proud about these kind of things. But <laughs> I will commend you for mustering the strength to prevail. Even among her kin, that one seems to have a particular lust for blood. In which case, we can't assume the others will fall. Light it up. Coming in 20... Oh, fuck. Oh, look. Devil. Best contact. Dude, they're advertising demons, Speaking I guess. Guests from the netherworld. Shouldn't you be on your way? It seems the barrier protecting Tokyo has been broken. Demons have begun flooding in. The barrier was likely positioned at Josoji Temple. I suggest we hurry there. Let's go hang out with our I friend Goku. Angels will stand a chance. <laughs> I like how Nuwa still has the green face, even in this, um, even in the bisexual lighting, uh, glitch. <laughs> I'll fuse that bad boy. Well, we got one of the side quests in the overworld. It was the quiz one, but I assume the other ones might be a little bit later, eh. There it is. Good thing I can run fast as fuck for some reason <laughs> on the overworld. Yeah, Turbo Abuela. Yes. What a sight. Whoa. This scene again. 
He's level 50 now. What the fuck? Oh, yeah, it's Goku. I reports that Bethel was sending reinforcements. Am I to assume that would be you? It's looking like this game's got a little bit, a little bit of something for everybody. Like green serrated, I mean, not green, orange serratus muscles. And, uh, you may call me Goku. Probably having a pretty hard time Please watching this right now. Make your acquaintance. Hmm. I thought this was our first meeting, but I am mistaken. Are you nearsighted? I see now. You are the one who slew the Hydra. One of one of us is a giant Iron Man. What? Tokyo's defenses. We have it's pretty hard to forget. To I don't. I don't know. The city's safety. Unfortunately. The most recent attack I guess we were not Hobina, yeah, that's true. Yeah. I guess I guess I let that one slide, Goka. Okay. They follow the demon Lamu. And even now the Legion makes their way towards Joeen High School. Joeen High School? I that sounded like it was AI generated. <laughs> Back to high school time. Yeah. That was awesome. I love the entire hour we spent in the high school earlier, so I'm eager to go back there. But now it's time for another. Yo, level up. Looking sheen there. Looking pretty good. You too, demon. You guys also, I guess. Whoops, it's not where the school is. Yeah, I'm thinking Buddhist monks just took a level in badass with this Goku character. I'm gonna bullet point on that TV <laughs> tropes page real quick. Oh my god. Netherworld energies detected. This is a it would seem good way to play this game. <laughs> And this sucks, because like the, the glitches in the original version just made it like funnier, but also like, you could like look at it without wanting to kill yourself. <laughs> but oh my god, this is terrible. Did you come to help? We're, we're fucking we're beings of radiant light right now. Uh I did, I'm a good boy. Good. God damn, dude. What's the question? If you came here to help, <laughs> I sure mm -hmm. did. A demon that seems to be in charge. <laughs> I, I, I did. Oh man, this is very well. Why it's why is Unreal Engine like so fucked? Right, let's go in there. Can't wait for the school dungeon. I, I I literally forgot that we had to do the school dungeon before we went to the Red Sand area. So this is gonna be fun. Let me uh It's save. short. It is, but let me save and then Reload so we can get maybe less fucked up looking area. Wait, go into the world shadows. That that isn't as consistent as reloading. I I guess I should have waited for the world of shadows before I did this, so I could um get some miracles and do some fusion. But you live and you learn. You know, you know how it is. Oh, it actually worked too. You live, you learn, then you get loved. Yeah, let's um, recover from that awesome fight from before. We don't need this unicorn and this angel and this other, this other riffraff. There it is. I am certain I've given this to you, Rick, but hear me well. Oh, is this just a fucking fiend side quest thing? Alright, I don't care. <laughs> I want to do miracles first. I have a greatly increased chance of getting initiative now. I don't really know if we need anything super badly. Um, put in apparel. Increase the amount of it. Mm. I think I'm just going to save my glory for now.
I need to swear jar? No, it's... They learned it from watching me, to be honest. Because I was listening to, like, the Dark Souls bod the other day, and I was like, man, this motherfucker says fuck constantly. <laughs> he needs to dial it back. Let's see. Um, Infuse Jack O' Lantern. He probably has a unique skill. Yeah, Jack Aguila. I'll take it. You're not getting anything good. I guess all the demons just have garbage skills at this point, so you might as well just fuse Angel. It's all suck. Is this demon to your liking? Yeah, I can ban all of you. Hey, can we get a entire full chat ban, please? Oh, it looks really good. I'm not gonna fuse anymore because it looks hard to look at. <laughs> okay, I'm hey, I'm Shibanda. in a Uzume. I want her. Damn. Shidanda's like level 30, right? Yeah. You got some good. You got Medea. Hell yeah. We need that. I don't really need a recar. Revival beats are not hard to come by. Patra. I'll be good until we get the item skill for demons. Is this demon to your liking? Wow. What demon is this? Samenu Uzume. Oh, we can get the coolest demon now. Um, we can get that jack jack o lantern back. Nine thousand simoleons. I'm just gonna fuse another one. We got Jack. Get rid of Catchy. Uh... I guess I'll get the fucking Boo Boo in case you can exploit the weakness. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. And yeah, look, I'll look yeah. into Wellspring. I think that's actually a good one. Wait, do we have it already? Oh no, it's just it costs too much. Okay. Return. All right, new demon party, ready to go. Walk out of your unicorn. All right, I'm gonna leave Helphus in because he's our boy. Uh, who cares what you guys have to say? Yeah, that's interesting. I'm so scared. I should have saved, man. He thought she was gonna die, dude. You can save anywhere. That's true. I meant before I loaded this in case the game crashed. All right. I'm really surprised we haven't had a single crash so far. It's pretty crazy. Oh, wow, me, you look kind of cool now. Can't even tell what the fuck you're supposed to be doing. Yeah, I'm not a fan of the battle UI, honestly. It's um, He's got one of the kind of underwhelming. I'm glad they didn't immediately do like another Persona 5 style uh, UI where it's like, this is stylish. Whoa! You have to press the face buttons to do anything. Oh man, what the fuck? Uh, we got a helper. Understood. Why do you hesitate? This world is no place for a servant of evil. I can't even see your ass. So. We have no choice. Both demon and human must be purged. It's a good thing we've seen this cutscene before on stream. Yeah, I couldn't make sense of it. Uh -huh. so, love that. It is pretty crazy how Persona 5 changed the world and revolutionized the RPG genre. Accept me. Accept the you 
it is very funny that the the le the lesson the biggest influence that Persona 5 has had is that uh, developers are more likely to make their battle UI fancy now. <laughs> What a legacy. UI, the UI it was crazy. What a what a what a bullet point for the press release. I remember the sperms. He was like the original gooner. Alright, well I, I kept watching because I thought Yoko or Tao would intervene at some point. Oh, there you are. I guess they couldn't. They didn't want to actually like make a new cutscene with you. It's not a very chaos thing of you to say. Oh, this is pretty awful. Yeah, I gotta. I gotta reload again. Sounds good. For some reason, the world of shadows like really fucks it up. This drops a goddamn nuclear bomb on this. uh on the graphic settings. Let's save again. Yeah, I mean, the hype has definitely died down at this point because they're finally at the cycle, at the point of the cycle where they're ready to make another numbered game, I assume. Although, although probably. Um, so you mean Soul Hackers 3? Oh, yeah, that's right. Soul Hackers 3, now it's... Now it's all... Now it's, like, epic. They, they It wasn't epic before, but it's gonna be epic now. So it's gonna... It's gonna sell 40,000 copies instead of 30,000 or whatever. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Why am I talking to you? You're just, like, a little it's piss pants guy. Though. I can't wait. Going for this pillar action. Oh, you and Hiromine. Oh, you. Sahori was taken away by a demon. I think the angel said it was. I think I think Persona Five constantly trending on Twitter is like a psyop thing. That shit is. It's just ridiculous. It's just like a, a random character's name every time, and it has like six thousand people tweeting about it. I don't know what the fuck that is. <laughs> uh, that can't. That can't be real. That's not a homegrown thing. Yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. But Sahori, I think she was taken upstairs. I have to save her. I love leakers. I love leaker culture. Leaking is like a really important thing to, to do. Home? It's really important to learn about a game like two or three weeks before they make like a press release about it. Is too busy trying to protect the whole city. It's funny when it happens, but I don't understand that, there, that there's like a culture around it. <laughs> Yeah, what, what happened to him? What's his name? Uh, Midori, or whatever his real name was. I don't know. Yeah, what was the other name? Yeah, I can't remember, yeah. He was like a- he was already a figure in the community before that. His name was like Magic Gary or some shit, I don't know. I have to do something. I don't want to have any more regrets. Yeah, the algorithm is constantly trying to remind me about, uh, Naoto's birthday for Persona 4. So <laughs> Great stuff. Yeah. Yeah, if that's trending, then it's obviously just like bizarre, confused targeting from the algorithm. Yeah. All our goals align. Kill Lamu and save that. And with the saint's power, we will have a greater. Oh man, lucky. This dialogue is like that's fucking sad. insanely good, man. I'm not gonna skip any of it except just now. Let me, see, your party. let me see what she's working with. I forgot the fucking menu button. Alright, there it is. Oh, we got Tao instead of Yoko now. What is she... What can she do? She has nothing for HP. Oh, she has Medea. We already fused Domino Uzume, but you have Maraku Kaja, so... I'll take it. Oh, that's good. And yeah, a long time ago I downloaded a uh, archive of Persona 4 fan art. Fan art. 
<laughs> and one of the pieces is really disgusting. It's like all the characters shitting themselves. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> where did you? Where did you? Did you download this from hentai.com? Where, where, I don't know what the fucking answer. Uh, I forget. Called? I don't know. I'm like the juniors ago. Pretty good. You still have it on your computer? <laughs> <laughs> I do. You want to see it? You fuck that one. I want to fucking see it. Oh my god. I'm glad that you kept moving that forward, though. It's like we say. She's pitching logs. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What? No! This is so bad. Oh my god. Fuck. <laughs> Oh, they're weak, thank God. Jesus Christ, this... Right, we speed ran it. What is wrong with this game? God damn. And we are, like, way too far in to, like, switch emulate. Well, I guess we might be able to, um... Import the save over to Ryujin. We might just have to do that. <laughs> I keep my monitor's brightness at like 20. If you have yours higher than that, then I'm sorry you have to watch this. Big Batago, I ask that myself every day. And then I have trouble finding fulfillment in my adult life for some reason. I'm not sure why. <laughs> Oh, it's this guy. Your reputation precedes you, young man. I am Hayatero, currently assigned to support. Science. See, he knows not to like actually call me Mo Two and just call me like generic shit, like young man. I don't know why everybody else is Good. You're here. dropping a ball this is there. Hayatero, a sacred beast of Bethel and my partner. He'll be assisting us with the mission. He's like level thirty-seven. We're not gonna see him for a while though. <laughs> He truly knows no bounds. No, you see him. You see him sooner than before. Uh, really? Yeah, not bad. It seems they've attacked a number of students, even kidnapping some of them. I hope Miyasu is safe. The current plan is for Hayatoro and I to search this area for students. I'll ask that you do the same elsewhere, so we can cover more ground. Dazai should be somewhere. Giving Hayatoro is Mufasa. First real trial as well. Dude, that would Let's give remind me of like a Disney movie I watched as a child. <laughs> and you know I'd smash that download button. I hope Miyazu is all right. Tao, you, you want to help her always too? sound like you just got hit in the solar plexus for some reason. If we can, definitely, but... Well, I think Yuzuru can probably handle it. So that means it's up to me... All right, while this cutscene is played, I'm going to go get a bottle of water because I ran out. Be right back. <laughs> I don't care what happens. Oh, fuck, it's over. <laughs> Whatever. I'm still doing it. I'm looking for the Persona stuff. I... It's disgusting.
So yeah, this is most of the scene to the end. It took a little bit longer because I had to jump uh, a thousand new jhanas uh, over the the sea to Lanka. I fought, I fought many nice. uh, female Naga type demons on the way. <laughs> I got my bottle of water. I hope somebody in the future is watching this spot with his buddy, and then he gets to this point, and then he, he just fucking high fives his friend because that awesome mythology that fucking Ramayana reference that I just <laughs> threw down. <laughs> That's it. The Ramayana is very mainstream in the future. I love it. They love it when it's referenced. It's, uh, they made, uh, like, they got a, uh, what's the guy, Dead Dennis Villeneuve. They got him to direct a, a three-part film trilogy based on the Ramayana. Yeah, we're getting away with it. Yeah. Brian Cranston is in it. No Indian actors, though. Kind of weird. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Brian Cranston has taught you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, fuck. Nice. Do we to nah. Does it waste 21 MP doing that? Ah, oh, whatever. I gotta oh. fix this. Say goodbye. So weird. Just don't voice the. You can. You don't have to like do like the anime grunts and like the single words and shit. Like just don't voice the. Let's see. I don't. I, I really. Akami. I really hate that. That um like quirk of of, JR, of modern JRPGs. Um, yeah. That's. That's your. Oh, you're being mean. That's no. enough. Huh. <laughs> Huh? 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 Um, huh? Huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> they, should, they should have one that just... Uh, I'm thinking, yeah. Some fucking <laughs> shit like that. <laughs> but... What do you think about these slackers who weren't serious about lacrosse, Yoko? Do you think we should go and fucking kill them? <laughs> <laughs> Where's your- where do you keep your gun, Yoko? Yeah. Do you have a 1997 uh, Desert Eagle? From <laughs> Fucking, uh... All that fun stuff that happened in the 90s. Hmm. He did it again? <laughs> Come on. Well, now I have like a whole new perspective on this bullying arc. And Sounds I'm, good. About how bullying bullies the victim of bullying. Alright, we're almost done now. Dude, what if in SMT6 they have another bullying arc? Like they just keep doubling down. Like we fucking shot gold in SMT5. <laughs> I know why. <laughs> oh man. I think it should be a teen pregnancy arc. Yeah, okay, that would be too real, man. That would be... I don't know if that's like a big thing in Japan, even. It's more of like a... Mm. It's more of like a southeastern United States kind of thing. No one's having sex in Japan. No. <laughs> kind of the opposite. That's kind of the opposite of what's wrong. It's not enough teen pregnancies in Japan right now. Yeah. Well, that was cool. Hope it didn't pause. I mean... Oh, it's still like I guess I have to reload the save. Well, no, because the Shikamo fight was. That's a challenge. Yeah, just fucking. I'm gonna hide the game capture real quick. There you go. So you're, not look, you're not have to look at it anymore. There you go. This is like just white. This is not even. This is ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Let me unhide the game capture. No! 
Famous last words. He's strong. Arg. If a strong guy ever killed me, that's the exact same shit that I would say, probably. <laughs> Don't you hate it when you're... I'm just like, <laughs> your face in. <laughs> Don't you hate it when you're... Going to the fucking, uh... Going to the cheesecake factory with your lady friend and then a strong man kills you. <laughs> <laughs> and you can tell your brother. Yeah. He's strong. Got me saying he's strong. Arg. <laughs> the last thing he posted to Twitter before he died. Before he let out. Oh, fuck this again. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, shit. Again. <laughs> At least they're all weak to Hama. Uh, it's pretty. Oh, wait, no, they resist it. I wasn't paying attention. Alright, at least these are going pretty quick. The fucking Lamu fight never better not be like this. Oh, let me uh... Don't hide that. Here you go. <laughs> the fucking we have made so many goddamn cum jokes this stream. I'm glad everybody's getting in on it though. Let's see. Um, up the stairs. I, s I assume. Did I save? I don't remember. Wow, you again. And she killed you for the first time. They learned about pincer maneuvers and flanking. I really can't believe it's this again. I really should just reload the save. I don't know why I'm doing this. Uh, it'll be over soon. Um, we got week two. Can we the wind? Weird. Oh, she's weak to Pluto. Oh, too bad. There you go. You pretty much guess what's happening from the sound effects if you're watching. <laughs> I gotta say though, so far the Yoko stuff has been like way less smoothly integrated into the new narrative content than I thought it would be. It's very much just like how like a, a Tales game would do it, like where it's just the new character yeah. is in in every the new cutscenes and she says stuff. I just thought it would be more more in depth for some yeah, reason. Yeah, the new the new stuff is better later on. Yeah, it's good to hear. And the, the Kadishu stuff is pretty stupid, but... You're, you're cutting out. Yeah, the, the Kadishu stuff is pretty stupid, but at least it's interesting stupid. Yeah, that's true. Let me reload this fucking game again so we don't get the... Cum splatter battles every time, I don't know. Yeah, this stream failed the try not to come challenge. Every every night, it's horrible. Constantly crank cracking open the windows in here because of the stank. No, not August. Continues. That's true. I can't wait till no nut November when, when we can stop nutting finally. <laughs> Just like finally a, a, a reprieve from the fucking the vicious cycle of nutting. <laughs> oh, it didn't work out. Okay, at least you can see what's happening now. I'm gonna reload again because I don't. I don't want to, want to be like this. Have you ever done that? No, it seems insane. No, 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 no. 
Is that even yeah, like the like the fucking the mustache one? That's like for like a charity or something, right? Is that or am, or am I making what? that up? November. Yeah. yeah that's what I'm thinking. But like, but like, no, no, November is just, it's just for like psychotic guys who jack off too much, right? I don't, yeah. I don't know what's up with that. Because there's no way that guys with like girlfriends are like, sorry, babe, no, no, November. I can't uh, come this month. <laughs> yeah. We can fuck, but I, I just can't come at the end. <laughs> oh, this looks really bad. Yeah, the cock rain. <laughs> it's true. Is this just a dead end? I don't... I'm gonna reload one more time. I can finger you, but... <laughs> no blowjobs for me. Yeah, only finger banging like fuck it, like we're fucking middle schoolers. <clears throat> That'd be a rough reputation to have. The cum smelling guy. I like they probably... Upper management would probably not, uh... That'd be cool with that. No, go back up. Do we have to go up all the way over here? Oh my god, it's so radiant. Oh, fucking kill me. You'll run, you'll run into the does I. Okay, I'm trying to get an angle where you don't have to see the light too much. But it's... Stuff. I'm not seeing him anywhere. Oh wait, no, this is just the same. No, no, this is okay. I just missed this somehow. Well, maybe the battle scenes will look better. Sure. I thought you'd give me something in exchange. I would never help anybody if I didn't think I would get something as a reward. <laughs> oh well. Is that all that's up here? Alright. Can I break any of this shit? Nope. I vaguely remember that being something. I don't know. Nope, is this it? I just kind of walked around. Oh, there he is. Oh, it's you. Nearly gave me a heart attack there. So, uh, I think I kind of underestimated this whole fighting thing. Like that honor student, Atsuta? Now he is impressed. I'm talking about Went right up to those Yuzuru freaking sweat. Atsuta. I forgot how he said it. I'm pretty sure it was that. <laughs> because I couldn't get it together that all the students what the hell was I thinking like some dropout like me could ever do that kind yeah of stuff. you're still in school as far as I can tell you could do it yeah you say that no I, I can't do it all right well fuck you then I give up on you <laughs> Tazai, it's an understandable reaction oh Yoko you're here I, I didn't notice Focus on Sahori first. Agreed. He has the demon summoning program, so he should at least be able to defend himself. Wow, that added a lot to that scene. Uh, God, I hope that the fucking rest of the game isn't just me saying that every time this happens. <laughs> Calm down, lady. Okay. Well, this is different. Here. This looks pretty cool. We're, we're uh, fucking fighting in... Like Maka Tsuyi mode. Yeah, pretty much. It's true, the Demon Summoner program does make you... It, it automatically friends you to all the demons on their, like, socials and shit. You like you get the demon summoner program and suddenly you're, you're following Incubus on Instagram and everything and just pictures of his fucking dick constantly. Humans too. <laughs> demons prey on human weakness, though that's hardly exclusive to demons. 
Are you so, are you saying the humans are maybe a little bit demon like? Uh, let's get the nap. I couldn't mean take that high pitch voice thing for more than one one sentence. You've mentioned wanting to fight. <laughs> However, the situation is drastically different. Trying to stop bullying is one thing, but don't you think fighting demons is too dangerous? Yeah, so far they've made this part more boring by having Tao and Yoko say the most, like, insipid fucking dialogue imaginable every time something happens. Yeah. They're not that much different. My friend is a They're troll, bickering and... and I want to help her. They, like, barely disagree. Showing that there's always two sides to every story. Yeah. You can be kind of nice about it or you can be, like, kind of mean about stuff. Wait, you're gonna you're, you're ready to kill the bullies? I didn't even take much convincing. Your friend won't be happy if you get yourself killed trying to save her. I am observing a change in the son's personality and behavior. It seems to be due to Yoko's influence. This is how I would write the fucking game if I was doing a parody of like a Sun Tzu Fa. Look at Aogami's getting in on it too. Oh my god. I see. I understand now that human behavior. I'm oh. noticing a change in the same personality. Young man. Oh shit. Also change as you continue to interact with different people. Oh, that got me good. Well, regardless Fuck, dude. of what may happen, rest assured that I will always protect. I don't care if the story is better or not, as long as it's funnier, then it's good. Holy shit. My god, let's get out of here though, please. Yeah, really. I hope the next area doesn't look like I guess I guess it'll be nice that the area won't be red all the time, because it's gonna be glitching out constantly, but this is also pretty bad. Sorry. What's the plan? No. Dude, Aogami like says what we're thinking. He's like the Yosuke of this game. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna fucking I'm gonna do another save and reload. This game is stupid. Holy shit, dude. <laughs> fucking kid. Yeah, it's kinda of stupid. All the mechanical changes are really good, though. They, uh, I don't even have like that many complaints, <laughs> gameplay-wise, but Young man. they've definitely uh, thought hard about what to do. That's yeah, pretty there. fun. Yeah, but pretty stupid and brain dead. Yeah. Or at least there's just more stuff to chew on, which is always good. All right, well, we can see their, like, faces and stuff. Oh my Sorry, god. Stop! Don't do this! I doubt Soul Hackers 2 is gonna be, like, half as funny as this. We'll see there. Sorry! Please! Don't hurt me! Dude, who's gonna watch them kill the bullies and seems like, that's what I would do also. <laughs> You're really I'm Yoko Hiromine. After it never worked all the times I said it to you? When you were punching me, kicking me, destroying my stuff. You can punch me and you can kick me, but if you destroy my stuff, now you, understand you got a problem. Don't hurt me. I... Sorry. Well, that's... Video game cutscene pussification for you. I'm so sorry. I wish I could have done something before it got to be so bad. Yeah, I think we compared it to the Chaos Heroes arc you when we streamed it originally to so It's very funny that they somehow fumbled that same plot line uh, twenty years later. 
I was the one who pushed you. That's so much worse. <laughs> You're innocent. You don't deserve to be dragged into all this. It's also very funny to think that um, Uzawa and his gang all had like unique designs and sprites. Like he had like the fat bully and the greaser bully. <laughs> now you just get these two fucking generic, generic uh, faceless character models. Going to give this is just as important as they deserve. Uh, the Bethel War shit. You guys are still alive. <laughs> Pretty much equal. Sorry. I'm with you. I'm with you no matter what, and I'll prove it to you. Alright, this is the part where different stuff happens that isn't just Yoko and Tao reacting, at least. I remember this from the trailer. Yoko, you better cast Dio on my ass right now. Tao. Yeah, I like how they just hang out. I'm not alone, Sahori. If you want to do their own revenge, thing, what? I'll help you get it. What is this? Don't do this, Tao. Put it down. I'm not going to drag you into this. Please don't do this. They're not worth it. Tao, I'm not worth it. Are you guys like good friends? Now I have to do this. I never faced my own problems. Oh, right, the girlfriend else. thing, like the psycho diver shit. Yeah. No more. Wait. I won't abandon yeah, that's you. right. I won't. I won't make you carry this. They. This is like very. So don't like seasonal me. shonen anime don't subplot. No. Like more so than it was before. It's very SMT. Yeah. Well, here is a spirit turned into a body. Okay, I just didn't realize that at all that that happened. <laughs> Even that's you might have missed that when we played it on stream. As long as we saw that fucking insanely maudlin scene and he's not happy about it. <laughs> no! I won't! I don't want to hate! And I refuse to hurt Tao anymore! This is really tugging my heartstrings. Yeah. I know fucking. I know this is a lame thing to reference now, but there's like an early episode of Rick and Morty with like the fucking like I Ice T character, and at, at the end of the episode, it's like a very good line reading from the voice actor where he where he says, "Uh, I, I care now. You made me care more." <laughs> and every time, some like fucking plot line like this uh unfolds. This makes me think of that. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty much that. Yeah. Isunukami, get back. He's too dangerous. Best viewers on Rintex.shop slash two B V I oh, yeah. Whoa, this is like way more laconic than we've gotten in the past. You kinda excised all the personality out of this shit. Can we make KKO? Oh, I was gonna say make him a mod to be banned. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. I assume they always put themselves before anyone or anything else. <laughs> you, you're willing to risk your life. I wouldn't have worked that too well, honestly. <laughs> I said I'll do whatever. 
What would happen if we would do that? I don't it would be really good if nothing happened and we just did that every time and we had just like 12 mods that were all just fucking like bot accounts. I see. I'll do what I can This like half cutscene really sucks. Thank you. Oh right, we have to actually fight. What? She get immediately sucked up. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> the mud status. Here does mark up the mud. Uh see, I'm gonna lose one press turn icon before that. It really sucks. Can't see his competition. She that's true. <laughs> If you suck it. We have Amrita Sodas out, that'll work on it, right? What the fuck is it? Oh, no, oh, it won't work. Okay, well. That's good to know. Yeah, I'll just swap her out for, uh. Ryoko. Get out of here with your muddy ass. Uh, what does this guy lead to? Force, I think. Force? Alright, well, help us is about to fucking clean up then. I resist it. Nice. We got, a uh, Four shards. Um. We can't do much. So you keep healing. Oh right, I always forget that Joker can use items. Oh fuck, he can use Bufu. Nope, that's just... no, nope, that's... More than just one of the tentacles, I guess. Shit. Only four shards, we don't have a lot of four shards. Yeah. That's true, I did... I did, um... Buff up, like, the Mazan. <laughs> on the, uh... In the Tumblr post, so. Uh, there's truth in advertising right there. Lightworks, too? Damn, that would've. That wasn't muddy right now, it should be cleaning up then. Does he regenerate his tentacles? I'm guessing he does. Yes, mm -hmm. Which Which part of him is not the tentacle? Because that's all I'm getting. Or can I just not attack them until they're all gone? No, you have to do the tentacle first. Oh, fucking tedious there. Alright. Well, might as well have you use Force instead, because she can at least use Matarun there. Oh, she right. has like, only one left now. There you go. Oh, there's more. I don't know why. Weird. Uh, that anyway. There you go. It looked really good when they all just popped off at once. Oh man. Hell yeah. All right, bud. Whoa, you don't have a lot of HP. Um. Nice. Then we gotta fight him sperm though, I guess. Or do we or do we not fight him sperm mode because he doesn't absorb uh Zahori in this, this part? Oh yeah, he's gone. Hell yeah, dog. This is an easy ass boss fight in this part. It's kind of weird, it kind of right. reframes the original plotline as like a here, bad ending sort of scenario. I'm sure other fucked up shit will happen to other characters, but... Yeah. I promise I'll always be here. Why y'all lime green now? What? Oh, it's you. 
Oh, okay. Well, that's how they killed Raditz, so I guess that's pretty effective. Poor fool, Lamu. Such well, a shame. Too bad, I guess. Had you but known the truth. You will not recreate this world. I wonder how many times I've referenced the but the Raditz fight from the second saga of Dragon Ball Z <laughs> on the stream. Probably more than any other streamer, if I had to imagine. <laughs> it's an all-timer. So. Yeah. I, You're forgiven. I have an account on myanimelist.com, which is like an anime and manga tracking website, and um, yeah. it, it lets you choose like favorite characters. And my favorite characters on my profile are Raditz and Al Albert Einstein. <laughs> Who was in like a Naoki Urasawa uh, manga at some point. Yeah, they're pretty much the same character. They're pretty much just the greatest in the medium. What can I say? I don't know what the fuck she's doing. What's happening? Are, are Sahori and Tao's bodies there, or did they just disappear into red stuff? I don't even know, because this fucking scene is so bad. So far. We're gone. Bad. Okay. Sahori? Oh, I guess Sahori still dies. Well. You cannot fall whilst the threat to thine enemies remains. O oh, pitiable saint. The throne is in danger. Now. But hey, and guess what? She didn't give in to the siren's call of retaliatory bullying. <laughs> Sahori? What happened to Sahori? Oh, she did. That knowledge sustained too much damage. It rests now in a place beyond your reach. Yeah, they pretty much just had Goku come out here and say, like, they have more plot to do. What are you doing? Getting donutted. Despair not. For now your true purpose may be fulfilled. Your destiny has come to pass. Yeah, you should have said she's dead, and I'm afraid she wasn't baptized, so she's going to hell. <laughs> you may revive all the lives that were lost here. To that end, you must find one who can save this mournful world, who can raise it up. Let's look at uh, Tao's perspective on dying that one time. Guide them. It is your duty and destiny to guide them to the throne. Really flushes her out pretty yeah. well. Yeah, she goes into the station of sleep from Kingdom Hearts and uh, gets to pick from like a sword or a wand or a shield. Save this world <laughs> and guide them. Yeah, I feel like they pull out the character death fake out way too early. It's kind of a kind of th a thing you want to do at like the halfway point, at least. It would be so cool if the emulator crashed. I was just joking. Please don't fucking crash. <laughs> My God. Did it crash? Pretty sure it crashed. <laughs> oh, dude, no! I mean, it was a pretty short boss fight. I'm not gonna like, watch the fucking cutscenes again, but I mean, dude, that's. I was just saying, like, I can't believe uh, it doesn't crash yet. We've been pretty lucky, <laughs> of course. <laughs> it was fucking laden. Man, that's like a Russian dash cam footage on YouTube. It's just fucking annoying. <laughs> All right. I'm just going to let the game go while I also do a window capture. Give me a sec. Da -da 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 -da. Properties. Um, oh, I need to actually click on it first. Here we go. Russian dash cam. 
uh, compilation on YouTube. The first one that I got. Hope it's hope it's a good one. New properties. Here you go. You put that above the game capture. Hope it's working. Oh, did, oh, the emulator shut off. Well, that's fantastic. <laughs> Just give up. <laughs> and, the, and the window capture is also not really even working. Oh, there it is. All right, so we couldn't really... Oh, I see what's wrong here. Let me fix this. Sorry about this, guys. I need to... Properties. Nothing. There you go. Let me do another window capture real quick. This would have been a funnier bit if I had gotten it out uh, faster, but you know how it is. Yeah, I think we'll understand. Let's see. Properties. And all right. So basically what happens after that cutscene is... Um, Russian dash cam crazy drivers car crash compilation number 53. <laughs> uh, this video may contain some shocking or disturbing footage to some viewers. The video is strictly off limits for the faint hearted, the mentally unstable, <laughs> mentally unstable, <laughs> impressionable, as well as minors and pregnant females. <laughs> All right, well, you've got your warning. Watch this crazy shit. <laughs> Pretty <laughs> crazy, right? <laughs> that was not that exciting. That was kind of I mean, I we're at we're at number 53, so they might have they might have blown through all their good no Oh fuck! <laughs> the music. <laughs> it was something interstitial. <laughs> it just complete silence. <laughs> and then that fucking oh my god i can't Holy see it shit. are you not watching the stream um <laughs> you gotta switch to twitch all right the stream's not really loading for me oh sorry let me just share my screen we're not gonna fucking keep doing this actually let me just let me close this window all right so um yeah next time i'll, I'll just do that off screen and then get us to where we just were because I don't want to fucking do that again. So, yeah, that's uh, that's where I was going to stop anyway, yeah. is after the llama fight. That, that's yeah. good footage. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed that. It was uh, exciting stuff. Yeah, that's what we get for just talking shit about the game the entire time, I guess. Just kind of fucked me. Just kind of took me down a thing. <laughs> Also, we have this new uh, Stolis gif from Luna, so there it is. He's still not in the game. Alright, thanks everybody for coming out. Um, What the fuck are we doing on Friday? Let me see. Do I, um, I kind of want to do it's something. A story. I was thinking I kind of wanted to like, play it and a one-off game before we went back to Vagrant Story, but um, I guess to be determined, we'll either do Vagrant Story or I'll just pick something off the list that's easy to do. So stay tuned for that. A, tantal a tantalizing morsel <laughs> that I just gave you. All right, thanks everybody for coming out. We'll fix this next time. I'll probably switch emulators, I think. But uh, yeah, have a good night. All right, see y'all.